What if I told you that you never actually touched another person? That you don't experience the present moment? That colors don't actually exist, except for in your mind? I'm Len Cook with The Maverick Mind, where we explore the weird, wonderful, and sometimes disturbing truths that challenge everything you think you know. Today I'm sharing 10 scientific facts that will completely shift your perspective on reality. Some might make you uncomfortable, but all of them are true. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you're ready to have your mind blown and let's dive in. Please do hit that like and subscribe, it truly does help. One, you've never actually touched anything. Here's something that'll mess with your head. You've never touched another person, not once. At the atomic level, your electrons repel the electrons in whatever you're touching. There's always a tiny gap. What you feel as touch is just electromagnetic force pushing back. Every hug, every handshake, every kiss, all electromagnetic fields interacting, you're forever separated by invisible barriers. Number two, you don't live in the present. Right now, as you're watching this, you're actually experiencing the past. Your brain needs time to process sensory information. In about 80 milliseconds for vision, 150 milliseconds for touch, by the time you're aware of something, it's already over. Your brain cleverly stitches everything together to create the illusion of now, but you're always running on a slight delay. You never experience the present moment. Number three, you're almost entirely empty space. This one blew my mind when I first learned it. Atoms are 99.9999999% empty space. If you could remove all the empty space from the atoms in your body, you'd be compressed into something smaller than a grain of rice, yet somehow you feel solid. You're not really matter. You're mostly nothing, held together by forces you can't see. Number four, your unconscious mind controls you. Free will might be the biggest illusion of them all. Scientists can predict your decisions from brain scans up to 10 seconds before you're consciously aware of choosing them. Your brain makes the decision, then tells you that you made it. The voice in your head that thinks it's in control, it's just the narrator, not the director. Number five, colors are hallucinations. This is gonna sound crazy, but colors don't exist outside your brain. What you call red is just electromagnetic radiation with a wavelength around 700 nanometers. There's nothing inherently red about it. Your brain creates the experience of redness. The sunset you think is beautiful, that's your nervous system's interpretation of light waves. The actual universe is colorless. Number six, your brain runs on less power than a light bulb. Your brain uses about 12 watts of power, less than an LED bulb. But here's the kicker. If we build an AI system to do what your brain does, it would need 2.7 billion watts. That's enough to power a small city. Yet your three pound brain processes 11 million bits of information per second while sipping power like it's on a nightlight. It's the most efficient computer ever created. Number seven, you have multiple brains. You don't just think with your head, your gut contains 500 million neurons. That's more than a dog's brain. Your heart has 40,000 neurons of its own. These brains send more signals to your head than they receive back. When you have a gut feeling or your heart's telling you something, that's literal neural activity. You're not one mind, you're a committee of neural networks that somehow work together. Other people may not be conscious. Here's the loneliest fact on the list. There's no way to prove that other people have inner experiences like you do. Everyone else could be philosophical zombies. They act conscious, respond appropriately, but there's nobody home. You've probably met a few. No inner experience, no awareness, just biological robots. You can never know if anyone else is actually conscious or just really good at pretending. Number nine. Dreams are neurology. When you dream, your brain uses the same neural pathways as when you're awake. Dream pain activates the same brain regions as real pain. Your brain cannot tell the difference between dreaming and reality while it's happening. The emotions, sensations, the experiences are neurologically identical. Which raises an uncomfortable question. How do you know you're not dreaming right now? Number 10, you're not really solid. You think you're solid continuous thing, but you're actually more like a river than a rock. The atoms in your body are constantly being replaced. Most of your cells die and regenerate regularly. 
but there's a pattern of information that maintains itself while the physical material changes. You're not a thing, you're a process, a temporary arrangement of energy and matter that thinks it's permanent. So let me ask you this. If you've never touched anything, don't experience the present, exist mostly as empty space, aren't in control of your decisions, live in a colorless universe, run on minimal power, think with multiple brains, might be completely alone, can't distinguish dreams from reality, and aren't even solid. What exactly are you? Maybe that's the wrong question. Maybe the real question is, who's asking? If this video messed with your head, many of my other videos go into these particular topics in much more depth. Please do check them out. And please do hit that like and subscribe. We're just getting started with the weird stuff.